Let's go through what's going to happen tomorrow, okay? So I would watch this very, very closely. This is SQQ. I'd watch this very closely tomorrow. This is getting very oversold. I have a really hard time believing that the VIX is not going to spike on this. Now, maybe if we have a 2% down gap, there might be a play there. But to me, it just seems like the VIX is going to wind up going a lot higher after this evening. So we're going to want to watch that. Uh, I did throw a lot of ideas out there, you know, for you to look at. Um, I know that, but I really want to focus on these these indexes and what's going on. So you're still above, if we come and take a look at this, you are still above everything here. You're still above this uh, anchored VWAP from the March high. So that is impressive that you're holding that. Now, I don't know where we're going to be at tomorrow morning, but for right now, you're holding that. Uh, and you are peaking on the RSI, just like you did last time in March. So let's just let's just watch that. And also, there's just a couple key things. You know, just watch the fact that you're having a really hard time with this level. Like you're not able to get and make a higher high. You're just getting these wonky bars. And remember, last time we got wonky bars like this it was back here. The only difference is this is pointing straight up, which is giving us some buoyancy. And this is going at, and acting as a support. Now, if you look at the cues, why I'm saying SQQ, you want to watch it. Now, you're still above here, okay? So even with this coming down, right, which it hardly moved, which is kind of shocking. But if you see that you're just holding that level, that's impressive. But you're having trouble with that higher high. And this is much longer. But if we got rid of all these indicators and we just point out this very simple level right there, this is what you, this is what happened to us before. And I understand this is longer. But this happened to us at that 330 level where we kept thinking we were going to get through and then we just never got through. Uh, these dojis and the way that they keep representing themselves really start giving me cause for concern that if you get rid of the pre and the post and you look, you're really unable to close over that. So if you like this clip, click on the left to watch another one. Or if you want to see the entire video, click on the right.